Hi guys, my name is Joy. Today I'm gonna make a Jack o' Lantern Halloween pumpkin. I think it's better to go to a pumpkin patch before we make the pumpkin. Come, let's go. Do you know what is pumpkin patch means? Pumpkin patch refers to a garden where pumpkins are planted, commonly available for sale. Usually we go to a garden for pumpkin patch. There will be a lot of fun activity like petting animals, corn maze, and a lot more. It's really fun for everyone. This time we're not going to a garden for pumpkin patch. This is a pumpkin patch where we get pumpkin for sale. Here we can see a whole variety of pumpkins with different color, with different sizes, with this, different shapes. We can grab a wheelbarrow and go to pick our own pumpkin. They're selling some mom plants too and they're so beautiful. Some people plant colorful mums inside the pumpkin. Get a couple of large pumpkins and hollow them out completely. Fill with soil and plant the colorful mums inside. And put your decorations at the door or your walkway. I'm gonna pick my pumpkin. Which pumpkin do you like? Comment down below. Here also I can see different varieties of pumpkins. White color ones. Very small ones. Dark orange ones. Pumpkins with wings. Tiny pumpkins. This one looks like snake. This is the area of large pumpkins. Do you see this one? This is the price when our biggest pumpkin. A gigantic one that I have never seen in my whole entire life. Oh, $99. Hey, someone made a snowman here. Oh my God, who is this? Oh, I got scared. These are our poor little guys thrown in the trash because they got a little ruined. These are some moms that I saw in the pumpkin patch and I'm sure you will like it because I loved it. These flowers are so beautiful. These are kale. They have different types of kale for sale. It's a vegetable. It can be in different colors, green, purple, white. Leaves can be smooth or curly. We're almost done here. We can go home and make our own pumpkin. Say bye to these pumpkins. Bye. 
Now let's make a pumpkin for the Halloween. I'm using a water can for it. For the pumpkin, we need a yellowish orange color, but I don't have that color. So I'm going to mix yellow and red to make orange. Yay! I got the orange color. Let's start painting the pumpkin. Let's believe that custom of making Jack o' Lantern at Halloween began in Ireland. There are different versions of stories about Jack o' Lantern Halloween pumpkin. The name Jack o' Lantern comes from an Irish folktale about a man named Stingy Jack. Irish immigrants brought this tradition to America. And it became an integral part of Halloween activities. In Jack o' Lantern, the top portion of the pumpkin is cut off to make a lid. The inside flesh is scooped out, and an image, usually funny or scary, face is carved out. To create a lantern effect, usually a light or a candle is placed inside before the lid is closed. It is common to see jack o' lanterns on the doorsteps. It is also used as a decorations on Halloween. Now we can start painting the stem. I'm using green color to paint the top portion of the pumpkin. I'm not making any lids for my pumpkin. Because this water can has a hole in the bottom and we can put some light through it. I will show you how it looks like at the end of the video with some lights inside. The pumpkin is ready. Now we can make the jack-o'-lantern face. I'm using this black color paper to make the face. Let me cut the face from the paper, eyes, mouth, and nose. Is it looking funny or scary? Now I'm gonna glue this face on our pumpkin. Wow, Jack O'Lantern is ready. I'll show you how it looks like in the night with lights inside. Is this scary to you? Comment down below. Thank you for watching my video. Bye!